Um, another concern that I hear a lot about is allergies. Now, despite all the information that's out there, um, people still believe that um, the vaccine can cause or aggravate some, some allergies. So we have fear of needles, I'm sure is a, yes. is a big one. And the other one's allergies. Can you yes. address um, the allergy part? Like, like eggs or anything like that? Right. So yes, people talk a lot about influenza and having certain allergies and being the reason why they don't want to take the flu vaccine. So nowadays, uh, the flu vaccine, we have availability of egg-free allergy uh, for influenza, no eggs. We also have folks that said, no, the preservative or the thimerosal that was put into the vaccines caused me to have an allergic reaction. There's no longer thimerosal in many of these vaccines. Oh, I'm allergic to latex. That would be another thing that we don't have in our vaccines. So we've tried to really uh, reach out to all of those fears that our population stated that caused them to refrain from getting a flu vaccine because we know the importance of vaccination as the number one prevention against influenza. That's, that's great information. So um, can you share with us, Liz, some of the other reasons why, I'm sure you've heard plenty, why they don't, someone wouldn't want to get a flu vaccine? Most of the time is they're scared of needles. Okay. That's usually what they'll say. I'm scared of needles. I don't want to get sick this weekend. So those would be the most that we listen to. Uh, we used to hear a lot about I'm allergic to eggs, but that doesn't happen that much anymore because we have available vaccines for that purpose. Yeah.